mean, I wouldn't be surprised to see a pullback, uh, or maybe we just kind of stall out a little bit because we are up, as Mike mentioned earlier, that we're up o over 70 percent from the lows from last year. So. Here's the thing. I mean, I, I actually thought that Biden just did a very good job in calming everybody down, having a game plan. But the $1.9 trillion fiscal stimulus that he put in place or that he proposed yesterday, I don't think it has a shot at getting that number. But even if it's half, that's 2 percent of you, 2 to 3 percent of U.S. GDP. It's very stimulative on top of the $900 billion we passed in, in uh, January. So my point is we need to get all of these um, uh, fiscal packages put in place to act as a bridge between now and when we can get make progress on the distribution of vaccines. But it sounds like we're making good progress. And so I think we could probably see kind of some sideways action, just given that the economic data naturally is kind of rolling over again because we had to reclose many parts of the economy. I think it's temporary. And again, these fiscal packages getting passed, no matter the size, is very, very important. And it's encouraging that Biden uh, and, uh, is uh, willing to go out on a limb and really be aggressive, at least Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.